guys, welcome back to my channel. This is SH, and today we're looking at a new game that came out today on Steam. It's called Dungeons, and supposedly it's supposed to be very reminiscent of Dungeon Keeper, which is a big plus because that game kicks a lot of ass. So, here we go. I'm gonna try and be quiet during like any story integral moments, but other than that, I'll kind of be talking about, hey, what do I think, what's going on in the game, all that stuff. You know, you guys know how it goes with commentaries. Let's do it. Did you know that these texts are just a pitiful attempt to mask indecently long load times? What? No way. But before it's too late, as usual. He'll be sitting on his crystal throne in the lower level, doing nothing. <laughs> right then, off we go now. Hmm, how did that go? I'd better have a look in the manual. Hmm, I can't understand a single word of this senseless chatter. Whatever. I have to find the stairs down. Oh, whoa, so you actually use WSAD to move, hold down the right mouse button to turn. Whoa. To turn. Okay, so they want you to play this kind of like a... Like an MMO or just like a regular third-person game. Doesn't look like you can zoom out with the wheel. <laughs> look at this guy. He's got like... Uh, if I can turn him, he's got like a feather in his hat and a peg leg. Uh, doesn't look like I can click on any of that. Now, for the game being pretty new, and my computer's actually pretty good too, it seems to be running kind of choppily. So I'm gonna see if I can't just mess around with this stuff. Just a little bit, maybe just turn... Oh, it goes from high to low, okay. Maybe it's a shadow thing, so yeah, I'll just do that. I've noticed no difference, but whatever, let's just keep going. Don't these tunnels ever end? Talk about walking yourself to death. For the life of me, I'll never understand why heroes always want to visit our dungeons. If I were a dungeon lord, I wouldn't have to waste my time running around like this. <laughs> but my time will come. <laughs> I could keep getting lost in these damn tunnels, although it's just one long passageway. Alright, so it's just telling us normal stuff like the minimap, which is in the bottom left, which is kind of a weird location for it, but hey used to upper parts of the screen, but that's just me. Let's see. Let's see if I can't position this a little bit better. Oh, no. Okay, well, whatever. Wonderful! I finally reached the Master's dungeon! He can only build things here in his own area of influence. Everything in this area belongs to him, no matter who built it. <laughs> so, another look at the manual. What? Damn! I could have had a better overview all along. Apparently, there's been a spell on me the whole time. Well, it's time to put an end to that, let me tell you. So, it looks like I just... Got a new spell. And it's activated right now, so... Okay, 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 so basically there's like a spell book, and we're gonna have the hot bar kind of stuff, so this is kind of just like... We'll be like, wow. So apparently the spell is on the whole time through the eyes of the Lord. So basically, like in the old game Dungeon Keeper, you did get a spell where you could go into the f the view of one of your minions and play as them so you have direct control. So it looks like that's what's been going on this entire time and now I just turned it off. So now 
Now that's what I call an overview. Right. So now we're into like the main view of the game, I would assume. The uh Oh, just to give me more you can use the number keys one through nine to activate spells in your speed bar. Use control one, control nine to switch between the different speed bars. Use alt one to alt nine. Okay, so it's just normal stuff there. Can I okay, so I am still direct controlling this one guy. Let's go over here and see if these guys ah, wanna kill good. me. <laughs> there are the stairs heading down. All I have to do now is use the lever beside the gate. I'd have a closer look at the thing, but the manual says something stupid about selecting things with a mouse. And I have absolutely no idea what they're going on about. Okay, so it's just saying that you can left click on stuff to bring up a description of whatever it is you're clicking on. So I clicked on this mysterious lever. It's so mysterious! <laughs> Whatever in the world could this lever be for? Oh, maybe the gate that's right next to it. Oh, man, look at me. I'm so smart. And stuff. Yeah. Okay, well, I think this tutorial is pretty easy so far. I don't know. Let's just go down. Who cares about that? That other stuff. Servant is short. I'm victorious. Prestige makes your dungeon lord stronger. Did you guys know that? Because I didn't know that. I'm pretty new to this game. Ah, I'm done. Man, my game key seems to like almost crash what during the loads. I, your faithful servant, Mr. Psychic. Wish to warn you, your treacherous, devious girlfriend Calypso is planning to overthrow you. I'm pretty you. sure Calypso is like so, is that <laughs> the person or the company that made this game. Um, I'll leave you alone with your little toy, Honeycakes. I have to look after my dungeon. Master, I Arrival Lord, broken. perhaps? Obviously, I was misinformed. Please forgive me. Okay. What would have opened, Master? <laughs> right. That treacherous Calypso opened all the entrances to the surface and lured countless heroes into the dungeon. Attack! Oops, how clumsy of me. I do hope you can deal with this plethora of heroes, dear, for otherwise you'll lose your throne and then I'd be forced to move up. <laughs> oh, by the way, it's over between us. Master, it he seems bad. heartbroken. I'm afraid you've already gotten a bit rusty. <laughs> I will try to outline to you briefly how it works. Unlike some keepers, dungeon lords such as yourself, Master, are very interested in seeing heroes stream into their dungeon. For not only do heroes carry gold with them, they also collect soul energy but they only collect the latter when they're enjoying themselves. It is therefore imperative for us to first satisfy those heroes and then cut them down. <laughs> mm, that's Pretend weird. the heroes are like little pigs. We cherish and feed them until they become happy and fat and then... <laughs> well, you know. By the way, Master, your buddy, Diablo, works exactly the same way. He throws the hero whatever scraps they need to amuse themselves and sends them just enough monsters to ensure that they have an exciting but survivable struggle. Okay, maybe he hasn't quite gotten the knack of cutting the heroes down at the right moment. <laughs> and usually ends up losing out in the end. <laughs> but hey, let's face it, you 
are way more competent than that Diablo. In this particular case, the pigs are in the majority and uh, heavily armed, so I would suggest we make a uh, strategic withdrawal. Build as many prestige gimmicks as possible. This will they are giving you a lot of information right now. Us to escape. We should hurry. We need to reach a different level before someone manages to destroy your dungeon heart. Okay, so your construction menu is located in the upper right corner. Open it and select some prestige gimmicks to build. You can place them with the left click or rotate them by left mouse button holding down OK. Use your soul energy to reach the goal displayed on the left. Populate. I don't see it. See it. Monster level? Pew level? Oh, there it is. I thought you said upper. Oh, upper right. Okay. So let's see what. Whoa, there's a lot of stuff already. Veggies from hell? So you're supposed to, like. Okay, so. Where are these heroes right now? I don't even know. So if we like place that I'm gonna feed you I'm gonna feed you good demon face lamp on the wall That's good Sing Okay <laughs> they, they seriously introduce you with too much stuff I'm like totally overwhelmed right now I don't know. 